The creator of the Big Mac did not die from a Big Mac attack. Oh, it's not really uh, that unhealthy. Big Mac's maker, Mr. Jim Delegati, lived to the age of 98. It was nearly 50 years ago that he first served a Big Mac at his McDonald's franchise near Pittsburgh. It was an instant success, went national, immortalized by the jingle. To all the patty special sauce, lettuce, cheese, pickles, onions, and a patty special sauce. Where is the special sauce? There's a special sauce. The original Big Mac sold for... 49 cents at the time. Now it's as much as five bucks and sold worldwide. Though in Paris... What do they call a Big Mac? Big Mac's a Big Mac, but they call it Le Big Mac. You know they say that only one out of five millennials has even ever tasted a Big Mac. McDonald's didn't lower its flag to half staff, but it did tweet, Jim, we thank and will forever remember you. Fans posted Big Mac tribute photos. One suggested to honor his legacy, why not return the Big Mac to its former size? It's become so small it's pathetic. Not true, says McDonald's, it's been the same size since inception. Another fan suggested if they cremate him, they should put him in a Big Mac box. I love Big Macs. But even the guy who invented it in 1967 jumbled the jingle. Two all beef patties, special sauce, lettuce, cheese, onions, pickles on a sesame seed bun. I always thought it was pickles, onions on a sesame seed it bun. could be, but I say on a toasted sesame seed bun. Jim Delegati's family still owns and operates 21 McDonald's in Pennsylvania. For Jim's business, the Big Mac itself was... Our own secret sauce. Genie Mo, CNN. Onions, pickles on a sesame seed bun. Pickles, onions on a sesame seed bun. New York.